The Ministry of Information, Culture and Tourism has appealed to the House of Representatives to increase funding for the nation's culture and tourism sector. The Minister, Alai Mohammed, while appearing before the House Committee on Information, Culture and Tourism, says the sector is a non-revenue generating sector which is aimed at boosting Nigeria's image internationally. The minister says there is an urgent need to increase allocation for the ministry's bilateral and multilateral programs so that it can function effectively and achieve its expected objectives. We provide an enabling environment. We are not a revenue generating ministry, but we facilitate things to happen. And as I, you will see from Mr. Chairman and, and members, uh, when we come to constraints, you will be able to see what challenges we face. Uh, as a matter of fact, whatever you see here yes, in terms of revenue generation is only relates to the information arm of government, not to the sector arm of government. The sector arm of government is provider of enabling environment, uh, we, 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 we try to put Nigeria's image on the world map, especially culturally, and we try as much as possible to sell the soft spot, the, the, the intangibles of um, Nigeria. So we really don't have any department in cultures where we generate any revenues. So I move to page 13, which are the challenges and constraints that uh, we feel. We feel. Uh, most of the activities of the culture and the tourism sector involves a lot of bilateral and multilateral mutual exchanges, international and local travels, which are very expensive. Uh, due to inadequate funding, the ministry is unable to fulfill all its obligations in these areas. There is therefore an urgent need, um, subject to availability of funds and subject to your goodwill, to increase the allocation for our bilateral and multilateral programs. 